We've seen how useful it is to use Layer Manager to control the settings, uh, toggling visibility on and off, and just uh, by reviewing with particular layer sets, what settings are set for each layer. Now the page layers list has got some extra capabilities because we can edit the, the color directly from there. So for example, if I choose the boundary layer here and change that, we can see that the boundaries shapes have now been changed to green. Moreover, we can change the transparency, which is a number from one to, or from zero to one. Let's say I do that to 50%, and we can see that the transparency is changed. Of course, we can turn off uh, the visibility of multiple of, well, let's say that, turn off the boundary shape. It's there, we can now see that they're now invisible. What if we wanted to, for example, let's say turn off the spaces as well at the same time, All right, I can just do that from here. Or now, uh, if I wanted to, I can choose boundary and let's say space and toggle them on and off together. So we've got multiple select capabilities here. I held down the control key to select a second one or shift would be selecting within there, as you can see, but I would only want to do the space and the boundary and switch those on and off like so. So we can now affect multiple rows or multiple layers uh, within this list in one action. What if we were wanted to be able to get all of those desks there and all the equipment within them and turn them on and off at one fell swoop? or to change the color. Here, for example, I can do right mouse click on the toggle button and the layer shapes, do select shapes. And we see that they're the layers that get selected within the page layers list. Now I could quite easily go to change the color of those layers to be something which in effect creates a low light. And now all I've got now showing, for example, is the personnel on the desks and the data graphics. Now for this particular uh, type of diagram, I'll zoom in a bit. I don't really want to be showing the data graphics, so I can just toggle the data graphics on and off if I want to, uh, which is actually on the page layers tab. I can just go down to data graphic and switch that visibility on and off as we can see. So now I've got all of the personnel shapes shown. Well, maybe I'm not interested in the color of those personnel at the moment. Uh, the that represents the unit they belong to. I just want to see the names. So I can just select that layer and let's say highlight them in red. So now I've got all of the names on there and they're gonna show quite clearly identified against each of the desks and the desks have been low lit, all of the color has been removed and I can do myself a nice print in black and white, maybe black and white with a bit color, which is gonna be far easier to read.